regard it as a great privilege to have been given the opportunity to address this august body. I come from Pakistan. President Begum's here. It's a great pleasure for Nancy and me to welcome you to Washington today. The responsibility for providing refuge and a safe haven for nearly three million fleeing the repression in Afghanistan has been shouldered by our people as a humanitarian duty. I'm encouraged by my discussions with the President this morning and the understanding that he has shown for Pakistan's position. I have made it clear to the leaders of Pakistan that we have no choice but to impose sanctions. This president is a strong defender of freedom and the people of Pakistan, and I appreciate your leadership. We meet today as three sovereign nations joined by a common goal, to disrupt, dismantle, and defeat Al-Qaeda and its extremist allies in Pakistan and Afghanistan. Mr. President, Mr. President, I admire your statesmanship, your wisdom, and your commitment to high values of peace and stability around the world. Mm -hmm.